Hey everyone, Wanderbot here, and welcome back to Mushroom 11. What, is it just me or are things just getting shittier? They are. That is a freaky board on the background. There's like eyes that are just staring at people laboring. Uh, 1,136 people have been through or something. Uh, Shell, Shell, my fiance, has been watching this and she's like, Have you read any of the billboards? And I'm like, There are billboards? I mean, as far as I can tell, they're signs more than billboards. More than anything else. Wee. Wee hee hee. That was risky. It's definitely getting shittier around here. Oh, whoa. Okay, this is this is something else. This is gonna be hard to get that mushroom. Then again, what's life without challenges? There, we got it. That was actually a lot easier than I thought it would be. So we need to build up and around. What the hell is this? This is Mushroom 11. It's probably the most unique puzzle platformer I've ever played. Shit. And we, of course we don't get the, uh, we lose the mushroom. Thank, thank you. It's, it's interesting. I actually really like it. It's, it's very clever. It's like if you were trying to use claymation to solve solve problems. Nope. Okay. At least it deleted the right side of things before it got hairy. What if what if we're split? No. I I swear we have to get to the top of that thing. There's no way we we have to get inside of it. That'd be that'd be some kind of nightmare. Uh, every time I get close to it, I lose it. Oh well, it's not the end of the world. It's it's a weird game. I will grant that very heavily about this entire experience. Come on. Nope, 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 nope. We are not losing that. Mushroom. I worked so hard to get it. Twice. The problem is cresting that edge with this fat fungus doesn't work so great. Oh, man, why am I just playing hard games tonight? First Crypt Arc. Then... Then Human Resource Machine. Then... Mushroom 11. Beautiful. Okay. Let's see. I uh, can't tell immediately. Is the circle shape pushing the goo? Sort of. What it does, it deletes the goo on one side and the goo regrows on the other. Yep, what if I am supposed to be inside that thing? God, I hope not. Nope! It is. I am supposed to be inside of it. It's not coming back, is it? Please tell me it's coming back. It ain't coming back. Alright, guess we gotta go, that, go get, get that mushroom again. Yay, into the lava we go. It does not want to go. It really does not. Okay. Actually, we want to get that mushroom first. In retrospect. Come on, grab it. There we go. Got it. Oh, right, we dropped a piece on it. That was good enough. Okay, so the worry here is falling into the lava, but if I can get inside... Then we're safe. Okay, cool. Okay, perfect. Now we gotta now we get up gotta get up onto those hooks, those bill hook looking things. At least I can grow fairly well here. Okay. This is definitely a very machinarium feeling game. The more I play it, the more I just think, yep, this is this is pretty much a cross between Machinarium and, um... Oh, jeez. I can keep going up here, can't I? Really don't want to. Oh! No, 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 no! Damn. I don't know. You know what? For the sake of efficiency and sanity, 
I'm not sure how much I'm going to be pursuing some of those uh, particularly hard to reach creatures. There we go. Because I can't imagine that's going to be an easy task. Come on, get in there. Thank you. In the future. Oh no, oh no, oh no, 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 no. There we go. Okay. Just mold yourself around that hook, and we will be safe. Forever and ever. Okay, cool. Now what? Because we've got those platforms above us. I can't imagine it's easy to get up there. I can try, but it would be a mess. Getting to the this platform killed me last time, but that's because I had momentum. And so did the platform. Oh, it's not that it had momentum. It's that... Okay, there we go. So there's one. So we need to make sure that it does not... Go past and around. Okay, cool. So now we want to do is get tall. Because I want to go up. I want to see if I can get up. If I can't get up, then we just accept it, go back down, and, you know, go down that hole. Oh, yeah. There's shit up there. How easy is it to get to? Hell if I know. The answer is not easy at all, but I believe in myself, and I believe in my ability to puzzle platform. Okay, cool. We made it. It was hard, but we made it. It actually wasn't as hard as I thought it was. This is only like level four, too, which is kind of horrifying. Wait, nope, 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 nope. Okay, so what we want to do... Not get dropped by the hook, but I think we're safe there. But we want to kind of squelch off. Right about now. Straight in the lava we go. There we go. Just a little bit of burning. Didn't hurt anybody. Okay. Safety. And checkpoint. Beautiful. I feel like I'm a secret finding machine, but really I'm just kind of splorgy. I know splorgy really isn't actually a word. I don't think so anyway. It shouldn't be. It'd be pretty embarrassing if it was. Uh, but you know what? I'm going to use it for this situation because I think splorgy fits my personal situation beautifully. Okay, getting through this thing is going to be obnoxious. How the hell? I think I've only hampered myself in this situation. Okay, there we go. Now what we want to do... Nuts. What we want to do is get that that thing, but... How, how thingable is it? I don't know. Yeah, the problem is you need to have, like, a fair amount of, like horizontal presence to get it. Hey, apples and bananas. It's a fun name. Okay, come on. What if I tried to do it from the top? Try to just grow sideways once I make it there, because I'm trying to just leap sideways with a, a thing that really doesn't leap. Oh, we got it. Hey, got it. So I guess just by flinging bits of ourselves, we make it. And this is a very flyin esque level, if I do say myself. Say, oh, shoot. Oh, that's terrifying. Okay, so we want to do this. We want it to uh, give us enough room to maneuver. So now. Nice. That's clever. I like this. What is this game and what is it about? It's Mushrooms, Mushroom 11, and it's quite possibly one of the most interesting puzzle platformers I've ever played. 
I get the feeling going down here is going to end in sorrow and sadness. Fuck. Okay. So we need we need to be rounder. We need to work on our roundness. We want to be round. We don't want to roll. Well, we want. We, why am I sliding backwards in this situation? Come on. Didn't work. What if? Oh, what if I did this? Doesn't work. Okay. I was really hoping. Oh. Okay, looks like the javelin method works. Assuming that we don't go falling into the the lava-based void. Those spikes look kind of concerning. Honestly. But that's okay. Because I am a splorgy individual. Ah, shoot. We missed it. <laughs> we need to make it rounder. It turns into a square. Man, have you ever tried sculpting a splorg? Looks like the toboggan shape is the uh, optimum situation. Okay. Well, that worked. Let's hit up the checkpoint first, then we'll go back for the bits. Okay, so we've got the checkpoint. Let's go for the bits. Oh yeah, this is much easier. Shoot. Except for when one of your bits falls down and you end up going that direction. Yeah. Okay. We'll get there. I believe. Damn it. That killed me. That sucked. Uh, let's see. I guess I probably should have gotten as many of those things as possible before I... I went falling into the spikes. It's rough that the spikes just auto-kill you. But I guess it is what it is. I wonder if there's a way of re-triggering the checkpoint with the new things I've gotten. I don't know. I doubt it. Nuts. Okay. Come on, splurg. We got shit to splurg. Okay, we've bridged the gap. Now it's just a matter of time. There we go, got it. See, no effort. I don't think there's anything on the other side for me to worry about either. So, let's hope we don't have to backtrack for collectibles, as that is usually an inconvenience. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. Fuck. And of course, because I got the checkpoint after I got these, I have to go back for all of them. That sucks. I don't like that that much. If you hit a checkpoint repeatedly, it should consider all of your progress since you last hit it. It shouldn't be kind of like a one and done situation. Woo! That was slick. That looks like algae. I think it's supposed to be just like some kind of proto fungus thing. Ah, uh, yes, no, yes, no. Okay, good, safe. Woo! If I could just cut off a smidge. That didn't work. If I can just cut off a smidge and leave it the other direction, no, it doesn't work. Well, that's a shame. It really is kind of a damned if you do, damned if you... Come on, fall! Okay. I can do this. I can play on the Ferris wheel. Okay, I got I got the creature bit. Now it's just a matter of keeping a loft. Okay, we want to go this way. Nope. Okay, okay, okay. I believe. I believe in myself. I believe I can do great things if I try. Really freaking hard. Nope, nope, nope. Shit.
I was so close. If I could, if only I could mash, master the art of mushroom foo. I'm getting there. Like it definitely, it definitely is a skill that you acquire playing in this game. I'm just gonna keep falling until it's in position. There we go. Okay, so we got this going for us. Now this next bit is obviously pure terror. Got it. But I believe in myself and the things that I can do with this mouse. Okay, got it. Woo! Hard game. But I dig it. Okay. So getting into the mechanism here is going to be a little bit of a chore. Alternatively... No, it ain't. Um, hold on. Gotta not get eaten up by that fully, but if we want to get the collectibles hiding in there, we gotta we gotta be sneak thief all day long. Okay, there we go. Well, let's just wiggle our our slimy little tush all the way. Over into Slimy Town. Come on. Come on, Slimy Town. We did not go to Slimy Town today. Well, we did go to Slimy Town. We've been in Slimy Town. This is just non-stop Slimy Town. But, I mean, Sli Slimy Town. You know, the, the fancy bits. There we go. Hit it with my bit. Oh. I see. What the deuce am I supposed to do this? What? Wow! This game! Do those bits make my fungi better? Nope. Kinda wish. Come on, keep doing it. I believe in you. There we go. I believe we can do this with the power of teamwork and gears and shit. We don't want that little dongly bit. Okay, so we wanna we wanna kind of reshape it around here. We need room for this one to maneuver. We're so close. Well, we don't need that there. We don't need them. Come on. I mean, realistically, at this point, I'm probably okay. There we go. Infinifoods, now made with more shrimp flavor. What? Oh, that's interesting. Okay. I guess as it comes back? Nope, that didn't work, and that's all... Oh, this is disconcerting. What if I... You know, I might be able to just extend... Just by cutting myself repeatedly. In the direction we need to go. There we go. Got it. You ain't pushing me away. Oh, boy. Well, we need to... We need to... Suit all of these things. Without falling onto the spikes. Obviously. Come on. I believe in myself. There we go. Beautiful. There's a lot of believing in yourself that you have to do in in uh, Mushroom 11. It is a non-stop belief fest of... Okay, I got it. I, I see what I'm supposed to do here. Oh, 
this is inconvenient. Okay. Well, at least we don't have any collectibles that we need to come around. However, the situation here is kind of obnoxiously dire. Okay, so what we need to do is not move this one at all, if at all possible. Actually, it doesn't matter too much. Wait. That was actually a solution, of sorts. Unfortunately, we seem to have lost all momentum. I didn't even realize there were collectibles over there. Uh, let's see. Yeah, there's a lot of belief in yourself that this game forces you through. And it's all nonsense. It's all bullshit. You know what? What if we just did kind of the loop-de-loo? We did a loop-de-loo. -loop. Nope. Well, that sucks. Uh-huh. Come on. Come on, you fat slime. This is some kind of physics that we are we are currently engaging in. Got them both. All right. Oh, got it. Got it. Got it. Oh fuck. Well, this mostly works. Like the little middle finger that that one's given. All right, perfect. Perfect, we got them all. We got the checkpoint too. There's probably something up there, isn't there? I don't know. I probably will never find out. Well, at least we've hit that checkpoint there. So we need to take this one out. No, it's probably not going to bring us anywhere. Now, I am stuck. Wait, this might work. We might be able to goopity gap all the way up. Goopity gap do goop. What do we got up here? I knew it. There's a thing. Is there? Is there not? The camera doesn't want to work with me here, so you know what? I'm going to operate under the assumption that there's actually dick all and nothing there. Oh, he's gone. That one ain't, though. So we need to... We need to unbalance this right here. You know what? No, we don't. Restart check... Replay checkpoint. There we go. So we've been here. Is that like... Oh, this is like the meat sausage stuff that we keep running into. Oh, that's horrifying. Oh, jeez. It's like cutting the butt off of, like, a weird bug creature. Oh, it's a shrimp pig. That's... kinda... That's kinda gruesome. Yeah, it's a freaky shrimp pig creature. Uh, let's see. So how do we get past this? Honestly, I think we just go up. I can't imagine doing this any other way. Nope, that is way too fast. So we've, we've got to go the other way somehow. Or we block it and get around. No, I think we go over. Oh, you know what? We go over. We gotta, we gotta be above and below. There we go. Shh. 
shoot. Maybe if I maybe if I'm on the um on the gross stuff. Like if I can bridge the gap if I can bridge the gap to the grossness. Maybe I can do it. What if I the old the other alternative is to go over the nope. I can't go over the slicey dues. Oh! Almost made it. This is gross. Okay. So I'm wedged in now. I don't want to do any more of that. So we want to make our escape during the slime bits. Yeah, because trying to go the other way just results in death. There's nothing over here. Unless, what if I just did this? What if, what if we can do this? As long as this little bit's there, we can scale this. There we go, okay. So I guess just block it in. Oh, we ate that, we ate that thing. There ain't nothing left. That's gross. Okay, so let's do that. Okay. So you got this one over here. Go up and around. Perfect. Okay, what else? What mystical treasures lie above these conveyor belts of death and destruction? Nothing, really. But I've... I've... This is a fascinatingly disgusting game. I don't even... I mean, it's not even harvesting anything anymore. That's... Gross as shit. There we go. Yeah! Just fling yourself offwards. And... Splort. Okay, nope, 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 nope. Now is not the right time, now is not the right time. You know what? Let's go backwards. Let's try that again. With a little bit more gusto, a little bit more momentum. And a little bit more burning to death. Okay, never mind. Those metal masks make the alien look like the alien heads from aliens. Yeah, maybe. This entire game is fucked up, man. And I love it. Okay. So we can't die here. Oh. Shit. Oh! 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 No. Damn it. So one of those goes down. Which ain't great. Uh. How am I still alive? Okay, there we go. Stop with the momentum. We're trying to go over here. We're trying to get this fly thing. There we go. Okay. Quick, quick. Fuck. Whew. This is surprisingly difficult. And part of it is I'm sabotaging myself in all of these aspects. Trying to go for rabid completionism over over just speed. However, rabid completionism is how the world gets more interesting. I don't know. I don't really know what I'm saying here. Okay. I do not want you to pass this point. There we go. Okay. 
We're good, we're good. Oh, you're gonna die. You shit. Damn it. Yeah, the problem is it's very hard to control your momentum when you have literally no way of moving this thing. All you can do is just kind of incentivize. How long have I been running this mission? 30, there we go. Well, this... kind of bites. I'm just getting tossed around. What if I actually didn't try and wedging... Oh, you know what? That's probably it. I got it. I'm gonna get the fly first. Then we're going to... And we're not gonna... Oh, crap, crap, crap! Shit. Hmm. This is hard. This is really, really hard. Unfortunately, I can't... I can't stop. Like, there's no... There's no, like, mid-round saving. There's only a checkpoint. Oh, crap. Like, I know what I need to do. It's just a matter of getting that fly and not getting done murdered about it. We're not going in lava land. There we go. Fuck. I was hoping I could fire myself out, but I wasn't feeling particularly cooperative. Maybe if I was small. I feel like the smaller the smaller the slime ball the, uh... More cooperative it is. Well. Fuck. Come on. Come on. I believe... Stop going backwards! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! The problem is, once you're going, there's almost no way of stopping. Because the deletion... The, pla the platforms all go into the lava for a very short period of time, so I need to be in the air for that. There's not an easy way of me doing that. Which is rough, and we only have a little bit of midair growth. Otherwise, we just end up being dead. Come on! Up! Oh. Fuck! Ho! Ho! Nope! Oh, wait. Yes! 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 What the hell's with the weird snake wrenches? That's horrifying. Okay. So I want you to keep doing that. How the hell? Oh. Well, this is interesting. This 
this is fascinating, honestly. Oh, 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 that's how that works. Okay. I don't know, sometimes this game feels kind of like a Mario Maker level. Not gonna lie. Okay, so we have that. Now let's flatten this out. Huh. Oh, that's not where I wanted to go. Shoot, so I need like a tiny little bit left over on this thing. My trebuchet mechanics are a little bit lacking here. But effectively, what I need to do is just leave an itty bitty little bit here. They can't fall off. Can't be terribly large. Okay. Might still be too much mass on the top. We don't want to fire it too hard. Well. You know what? Screw it. I've been here for a while. I give up. Jesus Christ. That's brutal. I'm not actually sure how easy this is going to be. Like, it's hard enough getting up to that one on the top. Good luck doing the rest. Okay, so we got that one taken care of. Now let's get our slime moldy ass over here. You know what? I only need a small bit for this anyway. I almost feel like it should be tall and like javeliny. And I I killed it. So I need I need a catapult well. I need I need two parts for catapulting. A main part and ammunition. Okay. You know what? Let's just expand this way first. I wonder who did the music for this game. You know what? That might not be bad. This is rough. Because the problem is... I needed to get just a bit onto this platform. Just a bit. Everything else? Will just get me killed. What if I... What if I'll make it long? What if I almost make it really long and, like, kind of boomerangy? Jesus Christ. Okay, so that was... That was the best shot we had so far. I like the long and boomerangy technique. I feel like that... Come on. I feel like that had potential. Come on, small eraser, you can do it. Yeah, so the longer it is and the boomerangier it is. See, the problem is it's hard enough doing three.
Well, that sucked. Yeah, because the problem is the moment you erase one, it fucks everything else up. I have no way of controlling where my bulk goes. Come on. There we go. Wait. Okay. I can work this. Will this work? I don't know if this will work. We can't have it hooked on, though. That'll get me killed. Let's try this. No. It worked better when it was an L. Let's see. Put most of yourself near the button, but make sure only tiny... Oh, that's not a bad point, actually. So we're still going to need to send most of our mass over here first. Otherwise, there's no way for me to get to the button. Okay, now let's delete all but the smidgiest smidgel. That we can smidge. Because, yeah, maybe, maybe you guys are right. Maybe if I'm tiny... I mean, actually, you know what? This isn't a bad deal. What if I'm just long and thin? I need to expand the other way. There we go. There we go. Oh, well that works. So for that, there there we go. All right. I y you guys were right. And I found the boss. Oh god, he's got missiles. I'm supposed to be fighting this thing. I'm supposed to shoot, go for when it shoots at me. Okay. Or do I? Oh. I get the feeling that's for later. Are you gonna shoot at me, weird, weird slug creature? Okay. So we need to... We need to take the claw up. Shit. Come on, claw. Come on, claw. Beautiful. I don't know what this is going to do. It might shoot at me, maybe. Getting over this is going to be some kind of nightmare, though. Okay. So, obviously, we just need to get inside this thing. And I might just be able to fling myself at it. I can also just die. Okay, so that didn't work. Uh, let's see. This is not an easy level. We've been here for 45 minutes, man. Come on, Smurgle. Smurgle it. Shit. Why did... What's with the hell... What the hell's with this difficulty curve? It's some kind of bullshit. So yeah, we need to be above it. Because otherwise we're just not going to be able to get within missile range. So 
Well, that's not going to hit us. We might as well start preemptively extending over this direction. What the hell's with most of these creatures and being armed? Like, why is there a, why is there a, a slime? Or not a slime. Why is there a freaking shrimp hog? Or whatever they're supposed to be. In a giant death ball. Nope, that didn't work. I was too slow just observing the thing. Got it. Okay, sweet. So oh, there's there's a gap. How many times do I have to hit this thing? Too many. That's how many times. Maybe, maybe not. Maybe after a certain point it just loses all... All, like, momentum. All ability to move? I do not know. It's an interesting boss design, though. Like, that's that's one thing I, I'm loving about this game. It's such a unique entity in video games that I, I truly do not have words for this. Like, for most of this. Let's just drop that smackle. Oh, come on. I had it. I was directly below him. Okay. Come on, hit him. Shit. Okay. It's... This is fascinating. Did it get... I got him. Uh, momentum's getting me, though. Okay, so the weird chain wheelie business is definitely getting to me. Fuck. Wait, is he still injured? Oh, he is still injured. So it doesn't... It doesn't restart the, uh... It doesn't restart the encounter. It's considered a puzzle. Oh, thank you, game. Thank you. Okay, because, yeah. Otherwise, this is going to be an insurmountable task. And I probably would have just left this on pause and gone to bed. If I had to keep redoing this perfectly. Good. I'm glad they went with the, um... The non... Douche nozzle game design. Decision here. I'm starting to hiccup, which is... A bad thing. My hiccups are painful. Come on. Damn it. I didn't cut all the way through. Uh, that's not gonna do me any good. That's not gonna do me any good. It's not gonna work. It's not gonna work. The problem is, he keeps... He keeps protecting the bit. What if we extend path? Damn it. Come on. I mean, I guess I could just suicide drop him, couldn't I? Because I don't need to sur survive, it's just such a time commitment. Failing. And it's hard to move this thing and, like, catch myself. We're doing a lot of damage to it, though, but still. Suicide drop. Suicide got stuck. Okay, and we die. But that's okay. It still goes. It still goes. Let's just squidgle, squidgle ourselves straight through the spiky dews. We can do it. This is a long boss fight, though. Originally, when I was, like, talking about this game, I was like, you know, this game would be a great, like, beginner's game for people that didn't play games. No, turns out that was just the freaking first two levels, and then after that, it's just like, oh, yeah, we're gonna crank up the difficulty insanely fast. Like flying, actually. Yeah, this game is flying. I mean, not one for one, obviously. But it really does feel like it. And for those of you that don't know, that was one of my first series on my channel. One of my favorite games, uh, puzzle platformers especially. But still. Come on, come on, drop, 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 you shit. Let's see. Need sleep and come back to it tomorrow. I mean, I don't really want to do that. Come on. 
Ah, oh, come on. It really needs a bigger window than that. Uh, because yes, I do need sleep. It's, it is 4 a.m. However, I don't want to just leave my computer running all night. I mean, you know what? I just realized... Shoot. I could I can just suicide drop him the moment he opens up for missiles. Didn't work there, obviously. But if I if I just blitzed him, the missile's going to pass straight through me, but chances are I'm going to hit him. I don't know how effective this is going to be though, unfortunately. Come on, just shoot down. Just shoot down, Buckaroo. I believe in you. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to get up to that. I'm getting a lot of, like, basic mastery here. Dang. Yeah. But the actual, the actual, like, hitting him is hard. Because there's a very small window. Is he coming back? Nope, he's not. He's not. Come on. Got it. Nope. That's no dice. My hope is... Well, that kind of worked. Actually, that worked out fairly well. Sort of. I mean, we didn't hit him, but at least we don't have to redo anything. So that bit's good. Yeah, good luck hitting those from not above. Man, it would suck if you had to attack this thing from below. That would be... that would be unpleasant. There's probably a good way of doing it, but I do not know it. I would love to see somebody speedrun this game. Ah, shoot. Oh, I got him! I got in! Oh, you just get in through the, sp the, the spots! Well, that's horrifying. So you're not supposed to take out all the bits, you're just supposed to leave, uh, leave room. Wow. Oh, that was something. Now what? Oh. I see what I'm supposed to do. I am kind of a horror creature. Not gonna lie. Okay, some bits of me are gonna go in, right? Yes. There we go. Now I am become the creature. Oh boy. Oh, I see. I just control it by pressing that button. It, the whole thing doesn't rotate, it's just. Can I just keep this thing forever? Well then. I got three levels left. This game's a lot longer than I thought it was going to be. And I'm okay with that. But, holy shit. This game is hard. I love it. So, I'll see you guys on the next episode of Fungus 11. Whew. And as always, thanks for watching. I'm gonna go to bed now. I'm tired. And yeah, that was hard.